Hey y'all, it's Betsy from Happily Ever After Etc. And I am back with another <laughs> resin project. <laughs> oh, my cat wants to go inside. She says, what? why are we out here filming? Can you say hi? She says, no, I'm too busy. Anyways, I am going to be showing you how to make a resin project, specifically this wreath for your front door. So it's an 18 inch wooden round that came with these really pretty wooden cutout letters. And I am going to show you how to add the resin to it to make it a wreath for your front door. We kind of love it. Let's get started. So to begin with, you're obviously going to need the wooden round and the letters. They come as a kit. I will leave the link below. You're going to need your resin. You're going to need your colors. So for this project, I used a white. I used a clear with these rose gold flakes. I used a rose gold glitter. I used this pretty color of, it's actually like a blushish rose gold. And of course, I used my copper, which is technically that little testers brand model paint. It's oil based that you would use for like model trains or model houses. You're also going to need your respirator. You're going to need your gloves. Make sure when you're doing your resin, even if you're in wearing your respirator, you're doing it in a well ventilated area because the fumes are not good for you. They're also not good for your pets. So I do all of my resin projects outside and I make sure my babies are locked inside so that they don't inhale the fumes either. You're going to need your gloves. You're going to need a heat gun to pop all the surface bubbles that we don't want. You're going to need um, a couple, I just use lids off of another couple paint cans to kind of keep your um, wooden round up off the ground while it's drying because you don't want the resin to drip off the sides and fall to the box and glue your resin piece to your box. <laughs> Trust me, not a good idea going to need some silicone cups and silicone stir sticks and we'll be able to get started. If all of that is just too much to remember, I will have the full list down below with the link so you guys can just click on them, order what you need. You're also going to need some ribbon. I used a staple gun with some low profile staples. She really wants inside. You want to go inside? She's like clawing my shirt. No, she just wants to cuddle. Okay, that's fine. And we're going to get started. We're going to take the cat inside and we're going to get started. Come on, Lily.
All right. Isn't it look way harder than that? It's actually a pretty easy project, especially when you consider we're just pouring resin on this. Technically, the hardest part is getting your letters to line up, especially because my Y didn't, but we just disguise it with a little bow. Nobody will ever know it is off center. Either way, this was a pretty project. I am absolutely in love with it. I think maybe next year I might change it up a bit and add a pretty like wreath around the outside, but I'm not sure yet. So leave a comment down below. Do you like it exactly how it is? Or do you think a pretty wreath around the outside would be a good addition? Either way, like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you think, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.